Hello there, Star Wars fans, and welcome back to another RebelScum.com video. And today I'm here, not live, of course, because this uh, review is recorded, but I'm here live on the scene at Star Wars Celebration 2022, this time with a figure review, or, well, figure model, we'll say, model kit review. And this is the Celebration 2022 exclusive prototype Boba Fett from our good friends at Kota Bikia. So you may have seen some of my Kota to be Kia reviews on our shows at Order 66 Toys back when I was doing more live toy reviews with um, Order 66 Toys or some of the Code of Bikia reviews I've done over on Bay 12 for non-Star Wars content. Well, we're going to continue that kind of content right here on rebelscum.com with our good friends at Kodo. Dan, thank you so much for getting me this awesome, awesome boba. Make sure you're subscribed with notifications turned on. That way you don't miss when we do review content, especially while we're here. So here it is. This one is one of their snap fit models. It goes together real nice and easy. This is part of their 10th scale line, so it will come with one of those awesome magnetic display bases. This one is perfect to go with your other Bobas, whether it's the Empire Boba or even the uh, uh, Kenner style Boba that they did very recently. I loved that one. That one was an awesome one. Check out that review if you guys haven't seen it. I think that might have been an old 66 review. So if you haven't, go check it out there. But anyway, here we have this one. Um, I even had a passerby earlier when I was talking about this. Um, one of my one of my good friends who watches me on the Order 66 show came by, his name's Michael Lynn, said, I had to pick this one up live at the con to go with my ESB Boba that they did. And Michael, I'm, if you're watching right now, I'm so glad that you did because this is an awesome, awesome piece. I got to see it at their booth and I can't wait to show it off for you guys so let's get this thing open here the box of course like their other 10th scale ones uh, the box of course is that awesome black packaging and it I think it goes very very well with the color scheme of this boba and of course this is part of their artifacts plus line And we'll have more content coming about uh, Kota Bikia here pretty soon, guys. Um, if, if I don't know if the licensing panel content's been posted yet or not, depending on if it gets posted before or after this video. If it's already been posted, go back and watch it. If it's posted after this video, well, stay tuned for that. But uh, my good friend Dan does talk about Kota Bikia and the future of that brand and some of the things that they have coming very soon. Of course, if you're here at Celebration, you can go by their booth and check out some of the stuff that they have to come then all right so we're pretty much done with the box let's take a look at the awesome model so just like the other artifacts plus guys it's sandwiched in the bubble so it's nice and safe for shipping there's your magnetic display base what's cool is the magnets are in the feet of the model so you can pretty much position them anywhere on the base you like i think that's the only piece of wait I think that's the only piece of tape we got. Oh no, there was more. Maybe I've got like bird vision. It was clear, I couldn't see it. Wonder what the laws of bird vision are. So as you can see, his arm came out. So there's our magnetic base. And these are really easy to assemble and disassemble in case you've never seen one of my Kota Bikia reviews, especially for these snap fit ones. So every piece that attaches is shaped to a specific port. So you just find that matching port, you plug it right in, it fits nice and smooth and it doesn't come apart very easily. But you can still take it apart in case you need to pack away for later in case you're moving or something. Maybe the wife's making you rotate some stuff out, who knows? All right, we got this other arm here. So the left arm's already attached. We have to attach the right arm. But before we can attach the right arm, we also have his Wookiee braids, which come separate here. So we just loop those over the sh shoulders. You can look at all that. You can hear all those people cheering here. They're sp celebrating over here at Celebration. Um, and we also have to put his blaster in. Now the blaster is like a soft rubbery plastic, even on the strap here. What's really cool about this is, 
honestly, it, while it's not in perfect scale with a Black Series piece, you could put it with maybe some of your Black Series figures in case maybe you lose your Boba Blaster with that. I think that'd be pretty cool. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and put this in his hands. We're gonna loop that around. We're gonna just, oh, we're gonna just put that in his hand like so. We're gonna put his braids over his shoulder like so. I think they want ice cream. It's the March of the what? I can't remember the guy's name. The guy who ran through with the camp tunnel. Oh, there! I did see a guy with a camp tunnel walking around. Uh, it's the whole. It's the whole crew. Of them. Okay, yeah, I, I got, I got that right. Oh no, I don't have that right. Hang on. I'm looking at the picture of the box. I didn't even put it together correctly. Okay. This part I did right, but I didn't do the blast right. I wasn't supposed to put it around. It. Well, it's it's your model. Do however you like with it. Post, pose it however you want. I'm going based off of how they have it on the box, which is like this. You can get the trigger finger into the trigger guard. It takes a little positioning and doing. It is possible. All right. And the head does attach via ball joint. While this isn't a fully articulated action figure or anything to that extent, um, it still does have some limited articulation. There's a ball joint at the bottom where the neck meets the torso and a ball joint at the top of the neck where it meets the helmet. So you can get some pretty sweet dramatic looking poses. I kind of like, I kind of like that a lot. And another cool bit of articulation with this one is the rangefinder also articulates. And there's a lot of cool, awesome details here. Of course, there's that awesome white color because the prototype suit was in all white. You got the awesome cape right here to the side, and that's a soft rubbery plastic tube. Now, it's not like articulated. It's not meant to be posed in various different ways, but still a very, very cool piece. Um, the details on the gauntlet, you know Kota Bakia does awesome, awesome job with the paint details. So you got those silvery bits on his flamethrower. You got his rocket right here with the brass. You got the hoses going up. You got the bars there on his chest. The spikes on the boots. Got some silver paint on the side of the knee pads here and a few other places. His knives and other tools and things. He's got all his pouches, his belts, his blasters painted, the straps painted. Such a such an awesome job. So guys, make sure you go, you go check out Kota Bikia. If you're still here at the con, they will be here all week long, just like we will be here at the rebelscum.com slash order 66 toys booth, which is 1235. Come see us, come hang out with us. We're very approachable. We, we like to be approachable. Come hang out with us. If you see me doing an interview or, or another video while we're here, come say hi to me. And for those of you who aren't here, well, I hope you plan and we get to see you at the next celebration. Stay tuned for more AwesomeRebelScum.com content, guys. Um, we have all kinds of videos going live all the time, and we're going to have a decent amount of content going live throughout the weekend and throughout the next week as we get you a lot of our RebelScum.com content from Star Wars Celebration 2022 in Anaheim, California. Stay tuned for more reviews and more interviews while we're here at Celebration. This weekend at Celebration, we also launched a bunch of new merch for RebelScumShop.com. So while it's not available on the website yet, stay tuned because it will be coming very, very soon. We have a whole new lineup of shirts, the Rebel Scum shirt. We have the Supreme Leader shirt. We have the Rebel Scum, the new Rebel Scum logo. We'll have these new Velcro patches going up here very soon. These are pretty cool. Some more pins and, well, more. So make sure you're checking out rebelscumshop.com regularly for all kinds of new awesome swag and merch. Make sure you like and subscribe with notifications turned on to our YouTube channel so you don't miss any of these videos. We'll see you guys later. We'll see you another time. May the force be with all of you, you rebel scum.